Hey lovies, how is everyone today? Happy Saturday afternoon slash evening because I probably won't post this until the evening. Well, I hope everybody's been doing well. I know I haven't spoken to y'all for about a week, um, but I wanted to come on and just hang out for a little bit, chat for a bit. I'm getting ready to step out with my honey um, for a little bit and go do some things for the weekend. Um, so what I'm going to get into today, so I think this week, well this past two weeks, because the ultra fall haul has been two weeks, I kind of have been purchasing quite a lot of things. Shh, don't tell my husband. <clears throat> um, oh, I apologize, you know how my allergies get. But anyway, um, ultra fall haul, well what that is is two weeks, and actually today's the last day, so if you want to go get some stuff, you need to go get some stuff because there are super awesome sales. Um, and so Ulta Fall Hall is two weeks um, and it was this whole week and then the week before that. And they have a lot of, I know everybody knows about the 21, you know, days of beauty where they have all the luxury, more uh, prestige items at, you know, half off. Well, during the fall haul, they have a lot of drugstore items at half off. And, you know, drugstore items are already a good discount and a good bargain. So during the fall haul, I go even and get more things because I kind of save up and the things that I really wanted to get, I'll get then because it's half off of the already discounted price. <laughs> So I'm gonna let you know the things that I picked up and what other things there are available and some other things that I got actually at um, QVC. And uh, yeah, let's go ahead and get into this. Like I said, I hope everybody is doing great. Um, sorry, it's been a while. I hope, um, scratch that, just completely scratch what I just said. Anyway, let's go ahead and get into this. For those of y'all that are new to my channel, hello, my name is Elisa Love. Um, and welcome. I hope that you enjoy the video and that you like it enough to subscribe and join our little familia. Um, and uh, I talk about pretty much things beauty on my channel. I love all things makeup and skincare and hair care and fragrance and that's what I love. I am a mother, a wife, and uh, a middle-aged Latina <laughs> and uh, let's talk. So the first thing I got at the Ulta Fall Hall was I went a little crazy on e.l.f. products. There was a bunch of things that I wanted to try from e.l.f. that I was really curious about. Some things I already use but some things I actually got because I was curious and wanted to try them. So I'll talk about the things that I've used before in the past that I like that I repurchased and then I'll talk about new things that I purchased that I just wanted to try out. Okay so the first thing, of course, was their Flawless Finish Foundation. I went ahead and got that. I used the color um, Sand. And I did get this. It does have a pump dispenser, and I went ahead and got this. It was half off, so I actually paid, um, I think it was like two something for this. Great. The second, second, the second, the second thing I got that I've actually used before um, is probably a cult favorite. I know a lot of people use this. So here's the thing. People say it's a dupe for the Tatcha Silk Canvas, which it is, but I don't purchase the Tatcha Silk Canvas. I have a little, you know, tiny little sample one. Um, I haven't purchased that in forever, but I do use the e.l.f. Uh, poreless Putty Primer. I actually already have one that started and I went ahead and got this one as a um, an alternate, a second one for when the other one runs out because it's normally $8, but I got it for $4 during the fall haul. And actually, no, I lied. I got this for free for spending $15 during the fall haul. That's what it was. So if you spend $15 regular price, you would get this for free and I got it for free. And I think that was the whole reason why I got the things I got was because I wanted this free. So this is a poreless putty primer. It's a primer. I actually use it a lot on my nose because my nose pores are really large and visible. Um, and as I'm aging, they seem to be getting worse. Go figure. But so I use this on my nose. I actually double prime. 
um, I use my face primer and then I use another, I use this on my nose as well after I do the whole prime. Only because I have a lot of problem with oil on my nose also and my makeup always collects in the nose area and gets oily in the nose area, but this way it lasts a little bit longer. Like this makeup I've had on since the morning and it still looks pretty good. At least I think so. I hope y'all do too. Okay, so the other thing I got was um, this e.l.f. under eye powder. It's like strictly for under eye and I wanted to try it out. <clears throat> it was like two bucks or a buck something. This is it here. And I got it in the shade Sheer. I haven't opened it as of yet. I'm going to go ahead and try it probably tomorrow. But I got that. Um, I saw, I read a bunch of reviews and I saw that people were actually liking it for under the eye. So I figured why not try it. They were saying that it doesn't collect too much as far as, you know, wrinkles and creases since I do have those. Um, so I wanted to go ahead and try that and see how that goes. The other thing I got and um, <clears throat> is the e.l.f. Jelly Pop Primer. And I have this one in the box still. It's the Jelly Pop Dew Primer. And I got this because I heard that it was a dupe for the Milk Makeup Hydro Grip Primer. And let me tell you, it is. It's really good. I really, really like it. Um, I put this primer on first today. I put it on all my face like I was stating and then I used the poreless putty primer just on my nose and I think it did really well. It gripped my prim my foundation. I put it on. I waited for like 30 seconds, maybe 45 and then I put my foundation on and I felt like it, my foundation just stuck to it and it wasn't like letting it go anywhere. I hope it sticks to it for a lot of hours <clears throat> because that will be wonderful. So the Jelly Pop was $4, um, $4 because it was $8 regularly and I paid $4 for it. And then I also got um, a couple of e.l.f. primer infused blushes. I got Always Cheeky, which is like a corally kind of orangey one. I have heard good things about it, so I'm curious to go ahead and try that and see if it works. So this is always cheeky. It's more of a, and it's really, really smooth, and it's more of a um, orangey coral type. And then <clears throat> I also got Always Rosy in the Primer Infused, infused, infused Blush. And this one's like a, um, I did notice though that the Always Rosy is not as creamy as the Always Cheeky. Well, this one is a rose. So that's that one there. And then there's the other one there. And then I also got the Primer Infused Bronzer, <clears throat> which I heard good things about as well. So I was curious. The only thing is that when I swatched it, I realized now, because they didn't have any in store for me to actually swatch, that it's a little bit light, but I think I can make it work with my contour and whatnot. So there's the bronzer. Here's the bronzer. Here's the um, Always Cheeky and the Always Rosy. So those are all the things that I got from e.l.f., um, which I was super excited about. Um, the other thing I got from um, the Ulta Fall Haul was I went a little crazy with some BH Cosmetic things. There was a couple of things that I wanted to get. Um, and so I figured, you know, I'll wait, I'll wait. And so since they were on sale, I figured, well, I'm gonna get them. Now, the first one I've used quite a few days. I wanted to wait to use everything before when I showed y'all on camera, but I got a little ahead of myself and I used this one. <clears throat> this is the BH Cosmetics Blushing in Bali Six Color Blush and Highlighter Palette. Now this one I had, my brother actually got this one for me. But since I was showing it, I wanted to show this one as well because the other thing that I got is similar to that. So here is the Blushing in Bali. It has the three blushes. It has um, three highlighters. It's so pretty. I really do like it a lot. Um, let me show you a couple of swatches of that. So that way you can see kind of <clears throat> what it is. So I don't think that these things have um, necessarily a um, a name for them. It just says 
blushes and highlighters. So here's the three of them. This is the lightest one, the medium one, and the darkest one. That's that one there. Now let me show you the highlighters because you know I love sucker from the highlighters. <clears throat> I forgot to get my makeup wipes again, so I'm gonna have to stop in a little bit. So here's the lightest one, the medium one, and the darkest one. Aren't they gorgeous? Yeah, so um, they were um, $16 normally, but during the fall haul, they were actually $9 and, yeah, $9, so. <laughs> and then the reason I showed you that one was because I got the Glowing in Grease. <laughs> It is the newer one. It is a six color blush and highlight palette as well. And let me get this clean and I will be right back to show you. So like I was stating, I got the Glowing in Grease six color blush and highlight palette. And I haven't even removed the little plastic from this one. These are them there. They are a little bit um, darker, these two, than the other palette. And um, this middle highlight is a little rosy as opposed to the other palette. Let me show you them to you side by side so you can see what I'm saying. I guess I should have had these things ready so I'm not struggling to death. But these are them. So you can see the differences. <clears throat> and so I was curious and I really wanted these because these were a little bit more warmer toned. So I wanted to try them, so let's swatch those. Okay, we'll go with the blushes first, like I always like to do. Mm. I love creamy blushes. Okay, so there's the three of them. So it's the darker one, the middle one, and the lighter one. Ooh, these are gonna look nice. And then we'll do the highlights. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I love highlights. I'm such a sucker for highlights, and I so shouldn't be because it's like, you're older, you shouldn't wear so much, whatever. So here's the lighter one, the medium one, and the darker one. Oh, gorge, 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 gorge. Super excited with that. So that was regularly $9 and it was, um, I'm sorry, regularly $16 and it was $9 for um, Ulta's Fall Haul. <clears throat> and the last thing I got from BH Cosmetics, which was a really big steal for me, so this is regularly $20 or 20 something dollars, 20, 20 something. And it was half off. Oh, so it was more than 20 something because it was half off for, or 40% off for $14. And then I got the $5 off $10 coupon. So it came out to nine bucks. So I got the BH Cosmetics Desert Oasis. <clears throat> and I actually haven't used this one either because I was waiting to see. And I'm sure y'all have seen this one before, but I really wanted it because I didn't have it before. So this is it there. So it also has a bunch of eyeshadows and some um, highlights as well. So I'm excited. I'm going to swatch a couple of the eyeshadows and that's about all I'll swatch for those. Only the ones that I'm like dying to swatch <laughs> will I swatch. Because there's a couple of colors that I'm dying to put my fingers on because, you know, I get all kind of crazy. So the first one is Hot Springs. Look at that, that's gorgeous. The second one is Turquoise. The next one is Cactus. I guess I should have switched more of Cactus. It didn't come out that great. Cactus. This one is Heat Haze. And then this last one is Sandstone. Aren't they so pretty and they swatch so amazing. I'm so excited. Oh, they feel so buttery. <clears throat> I'm super excited to use this now that I've swatched and shown. I couldn't wait to get my hands on it. I was like, oh, I gotta hurry up and do this. So that's what I got. Um, and they were super cheap. And don't think I got these like all on the same. Well, yeah, I kind of did. But um, <clears throat> there was a couple of other things I got. So the last thing I got <laughs> was they were having, and that was actually... I think it was this week. I think it was this week. I got the Pure 4-in-1 Love Your Selfie from Pure. It's the foundation. Um, it's regularly $36 or something. And it was half off. And this is the one that is the foundation and the concealer. So you can use it as foundation with the pump there. 
or you can use it as concealer by opening up the um, bottle and then using the actual doe foot here. Um, so I got that one and I was really excited about that because I have heard good things about it as well. And uh, so that was everything I got from Ulta. Now I did want to show y'all one other thing that I got. It wasn't at Ulta though. It was actually at QVC and it was because it was such a good steal. Um, so QVC is having like a lot of holiday kind of gift specials and whatnot, like gift with purchase or buy this and you know, it includes this and whatnot. So I saw something and it caught my eye and I was like, mm, crap. And uh, I got it. And for those of y'all that don't know about QVC, QVC and HSN are both like home shopping network and um, they're TV shopping things or you can also go online, which is how I shop them. So QVC and HSN both have like easy pay programs where you can pay a certain amount every month to get the things you want. Okay, so here's the thing I got. So normally this one product cost $40, but it came with two other products and it was $49. And I did five easy pays, so it came out to like, dirt cheapness and I was super excited because I was like oh yes please so um I got the um it cosmetics your skin but better cc color cutter color correcting full coverage cream plus anti-aging hydration serum plus spf 50 <laughs> and it is a cult favorite and I did get it in tan and most everybody knows what this looks like but just in case I will go ahead and bring it out it is this here and um, it does have a pump. It is a great CC cream. It is super full coverage, which is great. Um, but it does have SPF and it has anti-aging serum and everything. Normally this by itself is 40 bucks, but it came with the Celebration Foundation full coverage anti-aging hydrating powder foundation as well. Now this by itself is normally 40 bucks but it came with the actual well here here's the box here <laughs> i'm trying to take it out but it's since it's kind of matte the packaging it takes forever to come out and it doesn't look like it's going to want to come out uh, let me see got it yay okay so here is it there oh i'm sorry i got makeup on it now i am really anal about like felt kind of things. I don't like them to have makeup on them. So I normally clean them as best as I can. So here it is here. And then there was one other thing it came with. So already these two products themselves are like 80 bucks. And then it came with their double-ended cosmetics brush. Now this brush itself is 30 bucks. <laughs> so really, this is like $120, the things that I got, and I got it for $49. And I wasn't about to pass that up. So I did it. So that was everything I bought. I know a whole lot. Um, but you know what? They were a steal. And really most of the stuff didn't cost me hardly anything uh, with coupons and amounts off and everything. They were a really good steal. So if you want to shop Ulta's Fall Hall, go to the store today because today's the last day. I know, sorry. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video, lovies. That's all I had for you. Um, if you could, please give it a thumbs up. And for those of you that are new here, please, um, I would appreciate you giving the video a thumbs up and subscribing. Join our little familia. Um, that would mean absolutely the world to me. For those of y'all that stay with me video after video after video and um, that have actually subscribed and joined, thank you so much. Muchisimas gracias. Y'all do not know how much it means to me that I get to do this and that I get to sit here and chat with y'all and share the things that I love and uh, chat with y'all about the things we like, which is makeup and beauty and whatnot. So keep those comments um, and whatnot coming. I love hearing from y'all. There's popcorn going crazy. 
So keep them coming. I love it. I appreciate it. And I'm sorry. Sorry, popcorn's barking. But loveys, before he gets louder and goes crazy, I better go stop him. So until next time, loveys, have an amazing rest of your weekend. Love you guys. Bye, loveys. See you soon. Bye.